main card. Light heavyweight fight. Corby Vandegroof. Paul Bunyip. Man, I love the fuck them <laughs> Sorry, Randy. Fight! <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, this a huge fight. Vandergroof, Bunyip. Vandergroof in the silver kickboxing trunks. Bunyip in the blue shorts. Man, I'd love to fuck the <laughs> snowman in the ass. I'm sure you would. Meanwhile, going to this. Bunyip is so used to having the reach advantage in his fights, but he actually matches Corgi Van in reach, I believe, in this one, in height yeah. as well. Uh, a little fun fact about Corgi Vandergroup, not a racist. Big head kick by Vandergroup, drops Shit. Bunyip. This could be yeah. it. He's punching out, but Neverland letting this go, and how is that not over? I got the blocker. Paul Bunyip, the tough man. I guess Teddy Neverland decided that was enough of a defense. That or he was just watching himself, just drooling. I know Teddy Neverland likes to drool. He goes off the Never Neverland. That he does, that he does. It's not just an unfortunate name. Ah, he also drools on himself. Speaking of unfortunate names, Corgi Vandegroof. Named after a small dog. Literally. That's the first thing his parents saw in the, in the uh, hospital. Very dirty hospital. Yeah. Very strange Dutch hospitals. They let dogs run around. I think it was actually outside. Like it, the, yeah. the whole hospital was windmill powered. Yeah, and they're all and all the doctors wore wooden shoes. It was whimsical. Yes, which is unfortunate because it causes a lot of splitters. Big right cross by Vandergroof. He is just absolutely rocking Bunyip anytime he wants to. He is connecting, but Bunyip. Never say die attitude. And he is going into, he works into side control. And I want to throw some strikes here. And he moves into side, he goes to mount. This could be a good sign of life from Bunya, but he may not be. And Corey gives him his back. back. This could be the way to beat Corgi Vandegroof. He's a kickboxer, not very accomplished ground fighter. That is his weakness, as we saw in his fight against Christian Sundance, his only <laughs> loss in HCL. Yeah. And that's it all, of all people to lose to. Overhand left. Yeah. And you gotta wonder if Paul Bunyan saved by the horn there. Uh -oh. oh, I think he was. That last punch was not good. And what, what power, what strength from Corgi Vandergroup taking out uh, Paul Bunyip is no, no easy out here. He is a tough fighter. He is one of our top light heavyweights. Yes, he is. Corgi Vandergroup, this could be his coming out party. This could be... The gay? Uh, just an expression, just turning a phrase. Oh. oh, okay. This could be his party where he gets to show the world what he really can do. And there's an elbow from the half guard. Bunyip just trying to survive. And you know, people have kind of forgotten about Corgi Vandergroove. People know about Paul Bunyip and his power. He, he again, lost in a fight where the winner was gonna get a title shot. So he was, he's so close to that, to that, that, that spot on in the rankings where he, he can earn another title shot. But right now, he is fighting from behind, taking a Rudolph. big beating. Fight. And he charges in, leg, leg kick, charges in with a, a pendulum step kick. Yeah. Uh, yeah. From the southpaw bunyip. Here's a little fun fact, all the directions are the same in the Netherlands and in Australia. That That is uh, that is true. Uh, I didn't know that. Corgi Vandergroove up against the cage, maybe trying to neutralize that long reach, but Vandergroove Good leg kick, they're just kind of trading punches now. Big overhand right. Oh, and drops him again. Bunyip is down. Corgi oh. goes into half guard. Into side control. He's yeah. to finish this one, but Bunyip will not die. He dodged him. Up. Speaking figuratively, of course, that he will not die. That's going to happen eventually. Maybe in the ring. Oh, another big shot, but he catches Vandergroove. Vandergroove has to watch out. He doesn't want to get too, he doesn't want to overstretch with his punches. 
Get a little too overzealous. He switches to southpaw as well. Big right hook. Down goes Bunyip. He is out. I'll get him, Matt. Oh, God, he's dead. Court even. the groove is for real. Matt, oh, just fucking for that one, Chamber. Hey, he's dead. He has come into this fight and shown all of HCL that he means business. And this is this is a marquee win for him. He just he switches his stance to southpaw. Throws that's his power hand, his right hand. It comes over the top, catches him, and Bunyip is out before he hits the mat. His mouth and eyes are open, he's dead. I mean, look at this shit. What? Oh yeah. Oh, look at that. Ladies and gentlemen, ah. referee Eve Levine has called well, a stop Well, he's clearly standing, so he's not dead, Randy. At one minute, Adam 57 seconds of the second round. Taxidermied him. Declaring the winner by I, knockout. I don't think Slim. you can taxidermy someone that quickly. He's on strings. Borgi Vandergroof with an impressive win. Goes to three and one. What an impressive win.